Hey guys, it's Renee. Welcome to this Spiral Pearls Clay Earrings. Say that 10 times fast. But yeah, these ones are super easy to make. To make this, I'm going to be using porcelain clay. This kind of clay dries with air, so you don't need to bake anything for it to harden. But you can use polymer clay as well. I just find it easier. You don't need that much, actually. First, I'm going to be rolling this into kind of like a really thin snake. Just rolling this like that. Once it's done, I'm going to be taking two sharpies and I'm just going to be rolling them around into a spiral shape. And on the bottom part of my marker, I'm going to be placing the top part of my earring. So it's going to be like side A and side B. Doing this twice and I'm going to let them dry. Then I'm going to be taking some more clay. I'm going to be rolling this with my roller that has those two green parts on the edges. Those are there just so that I can have the same thickness all around my clay. It's just so it looks even. I'm going to then take my Wilton 1M pipe and tip. I'm going to be using this as a cookie cutter actually, cleaning it after this. I'm going to be cutting this in two parts as even as I can and then have part again in half and then I'm just going to be uh, making two tiny balls out of that and I'm just going to let them dry. Then it's time to assemble the whole thing. For that I'm going to be using my pliers to stud earrings and then my super glue because these stud earrings that I have have like this um, big part on them. I'm just going to be taking my pliers while getting rid of that part. Once my clay parts are dry I'm going to be, remember this is A, the part on top and then B, the part on the bottom. I'm going to be cutting part A Part B pretty much depends on how long you want them to be. Cutting part B on towards the like back of the earring. So the pearl is going to be sitting like on the back of that. But yeah, I'm just going to be now gluing the earring part and waiting for that to dry. Then I'm going to glue the pearl thing. And as you can see, it's being glued on like the back of the uh, spiral. To paint the pearl, I thought I was filming when I painted the first coat, but turns out I wasn't. I'm going to be using this nail polish by Fingerprints. It says Fingerprints in there, by the way. I've used it so many times that the name is not clear anymore. And this is the name of it. I'm giving this two or three coats until it's like covered. And then to paint the rest, I'm going to be using this gold acrylic paint, my brush. I'm giving this, again, two or three coats until it's like opaque, letting it dry in between coats. And this is how I let the whole thing dry. Block of foam and just like on the edge of the table. But yeah guys, these are the earrings that I want to share with you. I honestly really like them. I think they look so much fun, cute, uh, classic, but unique, sort of. The shape is pretty interesting and it adds something really cool to any outfit. I like to have my hair up when I wear them. I guess that they're fully appreciated and they can have like their own moment. And I really like the movement they make. It's really fun to look at as well. They're pretty easy to make, affordable. I kind of like dainty. And remember, this is made of clay. So I wouldn't go like swimming wearing them anyways. But yeah, I really hope you liked them. If you did, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to check out more earrings and custom jewelry that I have on my channel. I'll subscribe for more. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you later and take care. Bye.